This is Mario Central here with you today in Mario Kart Super Circuit and we are going to take on the extra special cup hoping to get rid of that rank D because it looks shameful. Oh my goodness. I mean the lowest ranking we've had so far. I mean I've gotten a rank E already but I, I mean so far on my uh, 150 CC special is rank C. So, I mean, I, I kind of want to get rid of that, but I don't know how well that's going to go considering I got a rank E with the lightweight the last time, and now I'm using another one. Yay! <laughs> this will be fun. Okay. Well, oh, you see? This is what I mean. Lightweights get always... Look at that! I'm already down to fifth! What is this? Okay, there you go. Red Shell Barrage, folks. Can't escape it. That's the one thing the lightweights have the advantage of. They get hit, they don't take that long to come back. Although... Everyone still gets hit. Oh, you know what? I'll save this for a good moment. <laughs> he knocked Luigi into the water, didn't he? What a jerk. I saw that. Luigi just disappeared. All right, whoa. Okay, hold on. What is this, the fourth lap? Okay. I'll let him pass me. Knock... Th that... Did that knock him into the water? I was hoping it would. Okay, that's okay. I got 37 coins. I'm gonna aim for 40, but he's right behind me, so... I'm gonna hope to just... Slowly... Oh! Bowser, Bowser, Bowser! Yes! <laughs> he fell into my banana trap. Perfect, and now you can't do a thing because I win! Pinch wins! How many times are you gonna see that? Oh my goodness. Wow! Alright, not a bad start. 40 coins and first place. That's a pretty good start to... Um, this, I mean, this special cup isn't too bad. I like all the courses here, though. I mean, that Koopa Troopa Beat 2 is pretty cool. I like this place a lot. It's not that hard to fall off of. It's pretty cool. I like it. Boom! That was a good start. This one's a pretty, this one's a pretty spread out Ghost Valley one. Like, all the ones are usually so narrow, but there's a lot of coins to be had in here. I mean, there, but the problem is, is you have to go out of your way to get it. So, it may result in me not finishing in first. Bowser! Man, how dare you? I saw him behind me and I was like, oh god, oh god, dude, don't do it, don't do it. And then he got, he did it. Harden <laughs> Bowser. He got me scared. I thought he was going to push me off the edge and I ended up falling off anyways. The fear of falling ended up happening. <laughs> what, isn't that some, some sort of quote? The fear of something is the fear itself. I don't even know. But there goes Mario, there goes DK, that's why you don't trail behind me, because I got three green shells, boy, and someone fell. Yes! Alright, I'm in third, I just need a couple good items here. That will do, that will do very nicely, actually. Go, go, go! No, 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 you missed, didn't you? You stupid red shell. Okay, that's okay. Hopefully I'll get him now. I just can't count on you right now, can I? No, of course not. Now, right now, I can't focus on these coins. I'm aiming for first place. I do not know how I just jumped over that giant pothole there. My goodness. I mean, I, I don't know if these are potholes or not, but still. Oh, man, this is going to catch me up. Okay. Well, all right. You got rid of one of my chances. Why did I do that? Are you stupid? Okay, that was my fault. Honestly, I don't know why I turned that much. Okay, now my best chances are getting third. I'm going to make sure I wait for a good moment. That should do it. And we finish in third. Not too shabby, although I think that's my worst coin total I've ever gotten so far. 17? I didn't even break 20, man. Come on. Was it? I think that's my worst one. And now we're in second. Now that's just great. Oh boy. I, I should have at least gotten second, because going in third really cripples you. This is what makes these older Mario Karts a little bit more challenging, because if you do, there is a penalty for getting in third second, you know? You don't. You always want to get in first because you have that big lead. The moment you get third and second, it goes away from you. Like, that. that's that's one thing I will admit is pretty cool with the older games. That you you really want to get first. In the, in the newer Mario Karts, it's okay to get second and third from time to time because, well, it's only one point less, right? It's not that bad, and you had to have a red gel, didn't you? Well, you know what? Take this. Ha! Huh. And now you'll take double time to recover. In your face! I planned it! I just said I planned it out, and then Luigi comes along and destroys that. This place is so easy to make shortcuts, and I'm really surprised I didn't hit him. My goodness. Okay, Luigi. Your dodging skills are over! Time to be rammed in by my three green shells. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. Come, come here, Luigi. I want to ram you. Oh, no, that's not gonna happen. There it happens. And now I basically won. I just want to get 30 at least. That's 29, whereas I need a 30th coin. There it is, beautiful. And I'll just use these two green shells right now and finish! Finish! Yay, I did it! Woo, 105, woo! 
I don't know why I'm doing that. Okay. But now, we're pretty much in the hunt now. I gotta get first. There is no other option, and this is gonna be very interesting. I honestly, I don't know what to expect. I have to get first. I, I don't have any choice here. I would like to get first. I don't want to get second. That would be the first time I've ever gotten second in a Mario Kart video. But as we all know, this Rainbow Road is quite tricky. It is, you know, the starting of the first Rainbow Road. And I, I gotta say, I always like this one a lot. It just, it's so cool, the music, the, how dangerous it is. One little push and you're gone off the edge. It, it, it started this whole Rainbow Road fiasco, and it just it started it off in a great way. And there's not too many coins here, but you get them in rows, so it's nice. But I'm not helping myself! Oh no, that wasn't good! Okay, good thing is I have five laps, so I should be able to catch up by then. Even with the slowness of Peach. Boom, see you right there, I'm already in it. And I already passed. You know what, go ahead. Go right ahead, Yoshi. I'm not gonna bother you. Why don't you... Oh! Okay! Oh, I see how you're playing now. You want to protect Bowser, right? Okay. Well, you, you've you started this, and now I'm going to finish it. Oh, Yoshi, you picked the wrong person to mess with, buddy. There. I want to push you off, but I want to save these two red shells for a reason. Okay, hopefully that hits him. I don't know where it's going. Uh, it did! All right, also, oh, well, you know that red shell missed, and now I have no way to protect myself. Yeah, I'm going to stay behind him, because I don't want him pushing me off the side. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I can't use it again. Come on, Bowser, use your red shell. Okay, okay. Boom! No, I meant to grab an item. Oh shoot! Okay, this is gonna come down to me and my turning skills. Okay, that was that was pretty good. I gotta turn right here, yeah, buddy. That was a good turn. All right, Bowser, stay right behind me. You know what? Take a take a green shell. Take a green shell. I win! Yeah, buddy! No, buddy! Whoa! I actually did it! Oh! I- whoa! Oh! That was amazing! Honestly, I wasn't expecting that. I thought I was gonna lose there. Once I missed getting the item with the mushroom, I was afraid. You know, that is fantastic. I honestly- that is a great way to finish. I don't care about that rank D. That- I, I, I must say, that was pretty good. But now, we're gonna switch over to the flip side of things. Let's go there right now. And here we are with Mario, the best of the rest, and my favorite character, and we're gonna take on the Special Cup on the flip side of things, and hopefully we can have a better result than we did in Peach. I mean, I must say, I was pretty proud of that. I think that went well. I mean, considering I don't normally do well with lightweights, and that's not a good start, but, you know, I really didn't expect to win that. I honestly thought I was gonna get second for the first time ever. And luckily, my turning skills just happened to put me over the top because, you know, you know, like heavyweights, they can they can speed past lightweights with no with no problem. But because he had to slowly take his time and turn there, you know, it uh, <coughs> and the way I was turning, I was turning really fast. It just it worked out. And my goodness, I really can't believe I'm, I'm still in shock. Like I honestly, I'm still in shock. But here we oh, you know what? There you go. This place always gives me a lot of problems. I like it. I like the background and this 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 theme, but it just <laughs> I I like how long it took me to say theme. I was like this 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 um what's the word what what's the word that kind of sounds like oh it's theme. <laughs> but anyways, <laughs> there's a lot of coins to be had here. I believe you can get around even 50 if you if you really stop and get each and every single one. But right now I'm just gonna. Well, there we go. I already got 30. I didn't even notice that. I thought it was still at 20. So there we go. I'm going to try to make it a 40, though, because there's a row of coins that I missed earlier. And I want to get that now, since I have a somewhat decent lead. Yeah, here we go. Boom! Look at that. 43 on the spot. As soon as I get the coins, and you have to take it away from me. You joink! That's okay. I can get back some coins right here. Boom! 41. All right, Bowser. You stay right there. And this is... Okay. I'll leave it up to chip right now and I win that's where you save the items that are important anytime you have a mushroom in a Mario Kart game I must I must talk real here anytime you have a mushroom in a Mario Kart game anytime or any sort of boost in any kind of racing game always save it for the right moment save it for a shortcut save it for 
Something. Just save it for the right moment, where you can overtake that person just at the last moment, or use a shortcut to completely overtake him. It just it works out. Like, right there! I didn't even think about that. I could've used my mushroom to shortcut over all of this. Like, and that's a massive shortcut if you have the mushroom right there, so that's pretty good. But right now, I'm just gonna take my time. I don't wanna fall off. And this place actually has a lot of coins for us to get as well. So, I kinda wanna take advantage of that, because that was pretty good! 40 coins first place! I mean, that's how it started the last time as well, although it didn't end up very good in the second one. This one, however, is very easy to beat the computers. Oh yeah, this one I find the computers aren't really good at the course, they don't really know it that well, and they just kind of, like look at that, look how far behind they are. I mean, I know Mario's my best character and everything, and he's, I, in my opinion, I think he's just the best for this game. I'm still, like, I have a much larger margin than I would have thought, and it just goes to show you by hopping across that, and doing little things like that, it just puts you ahead by so far. And I'm going to use that before anyone else uses it on me. And I stole someone's boo. You know what? That is perfect. Perfect usage of a perfect item. I love... You know, I would love to see the boo item come back. I'm one of those guys that actually... I really like the boo item. I would like to see it come back. Because I always like the fact that you can take someone's item, right? And that um, it puts a little... Oh, well, I guess it kind of sucks that it puts a little curse on first place. But, um, I think if they had that stealing item thing and not put the curse on first place, because first place has enough to deal with already, I think if they had put, like, uh, just put it in and not, not put the first place curse, it would be a good item. Like, you can take other people's items, use it at an opportune moment. I, I would, I would really like that. That would be pretty cool. Like, I was thinking it was going to be in Mario Kart 7, although it wasn't. But, I mean, I guess it didn't need to be. Now this place, I, besides Bowser Castle 3, I think this is probably my favorite one out of the very similar theme to Bowser Castles with the red and the Bowser face and this is probably my favorite one. It just, I don't know, there's something about it that looks different. <laughs> like it just, I like the turns, I like that there's little Mecha Koopas trying to ruin your way as well as the thwomps. I would like to see this one recreated, it would be really cool. They recreated Bowser Castle 3, they recreated, I think, Bowser Castle 1 from Mario Kart 7. But they never recreated this one, and this I would like to see recreated, especially with the background, because... You know, that's a kind of a creepy background, you have like all these, uh... Wires, and then you have like a Bowser face right in between them. It's pretty cool, I would like to see that in a 3D form, that would be... That would be pretty cool. I, I, wouldn't you, don't you agree? Like, that would just... I could imagine it now, like, for the Wii U. That would be pretty darn cool, I must admit. Although they would have to use a lot of... If they're going to go with the retro theme again, they would have to... For sure include Mario Kart 7, so... <laughs> that's going to be 7 Mario Karts to distribute over... 20 courses? That's a lot. But again, they did use a lot from the DS and Wii, so they can take those out. <coughs> that is a lot when you think about it. I mean, 20... From seven Mario Karts, you have to distribute it over 20 courses. I wouldn't be surprised if they brought back like a fifth cup or something like that, because that would be. I, I would like that. We haven't seen a fifth cup since this game. Whoa, Mecha Koopa, you ain't getting me, and I'm keeping my first place. You can see how large my lead is. My goodness, no one's even close. And I've got 30 coins, so you know what? I'm gonna finish without any worries. And in fact, to add on to that, let's throw some green shells and a red shell and create some havoc for second place. Which, did it hit anybody? Oh, it did! <laughs> it hit DK or whatever. And he didn't even finish! Oh, wow, I totally destroyed. Not even close. Bowser was... That was the first time I've seen that in the 150cc. I do that all the time in 50cc, where no one's even close no, that they don't even finish. I've never done that before in the 150, so that's kind of cool. Now, this Rainbow Road, I must say, it's up there. I, I would put this probably near the top. Wanna know why? Just the music alone, the background, what's going on, and these tricky turns, everything adds to the, to the atmosphere. I just love it! <laughs> it's kind of funny how I didn't mean to come off it like that. I love it! It just, I got nervous and it came off like that. <laughs> That's funny. But, um... 
I did. I really like this Rainbow Road. I think it's probably in my top three. Like, I like the stars falling and just the cool atmosphere, the music especially. My God, this is one of the catchier Rainbow Road tunes of all time. Like, I just instead of it being so majestic and everything that usually all the Rainbow Roads are, this one just like, oh, let's go techno and put in some beat and make it jazzy and it just it has everything and it, it really when you hear the song it fits the stage I love it it just oh this is definitely probably one of my favorite Rainbow Roads and seeing as how the first Rainbow Road got recreated in Mario Kart 7 I would love to see this one recreated or maybe because I mean it's the only one in 2D that hasn't been recreated and might as well do it for the next one and Bowser, you ain't gonna win me. Watch. Again, keep the mushroom for when you most need it, which is right around there. Oh my god, I finished all in first. And that sentence was totally grammatically correct. My goodness. I can't believe it. I think this is the best I've ever done. 36 points. What was that, like 130 coins? I got 40 coins in two of them. And... 35, 32, and, and, and the other two. I gotta say, this is probably my best ever Mario Kart race in a while. I mean, ever. <laughs> wow, I've never done this well ever on 150cc. I, I'm curious to see what ranking this is gonna get. Because I really feel like I deserve a star or an A ranking, because that was pretty darn good. But imagine, if this is the best I can do, how do you, how in the world do you get three stars? Oh wow, I did it! Oh, baby, that looks nice. I love that. Look at that star ranking. It's deserved. Well deserved. Oh, that looks beautiful. It's, it's putting up a tear in my eye. I honestly, I don't know what to say. It's, it's, it's beautiful. But with that, we are done with Mario Kart Super Circuit. Oh wow, what a, what a great way to celebrate Mario Kart's 20th anniversary than with this game. I'm glad I decided to do it. I mean, I was thinking to myself that, you know, this this series, ever since it started, is just one of the best multiplayer games of all time, and just in general, racing games of all time. I, I, there's so many clones of it, people always try to copy it and always try to outperform it, which I don't think anyone has at, at any point in time. I mean, I must admit, Sonic and Sega All-Star Racing Transformed looks really cool. It does. But I don't think it can come anywhere close to the, the classicness of this series. And just the, the, the greatness of the series. This is one of my favorite series of all time, and of course, it has to do with Mario. And it's just funny, how this is why I like Mario so much. And it's because of how... Even like a series like this, like Mario Kart, Mario Party, and it's among my favorite series, like even, I would even say like it's its own series, not even a Mario series. There's a Mario Kart series, Mario Party series, Mario Platformer series, I mean it just, I love it. I, that's why I like Mario so much, I never really actually dis discussed why I'm such a big fan, but it just, the variety, the, <clears throat> the amount of great games, and so much you can do with Mario it just it amazes me you know and that's why I, I really like this that's why I named the channel after Mario because of how many great games there are and how many how much variety there is in his games and I just I love this game <laughs> like I honestly still stand by it I will say this is probably still my uh, third favorite game of all time of Mario Kart my first and which I actually realized is Mario Kart 7. I actually really like that game. I think it's my number one favorite. I think number two is Mario Kart Double Dash. Number three would have to be this game. It just... So much time I spent playing with it when I was younger, trying to get good at it, and it's just... It was the first portable Mario Kart, so I mean, it was really cool. And you had your own version, and you were just playing it in the car, on the way... Like, on a road trip, or something like that. I just... There's not much more to say about this game. It's a classic. It, it does... It, the item usage is fair. The coin challenge is really cool. This is a challenging Mario Kart game. And 
Yeah, the courses aren't as unique as, say, the 3D ones, but again, don't really care about that all that much. It still does its job very well, and... Will I, dare I say it, this is probably the best credits music out of all of the Mario Karts? I think so. Oh yeah, this song? Beautiful. Love it. <laughs> when I first heard it, I was like, Oh wow, it's like Mario 64 all over again, I'm gonna cry! <laughs> I just, if you feel accomplished, like you beat the game and you're like, Oh my goodness, I actually did it. Like, wow. <laughs> it's, it's, like, I love games that when you finish them, you just like, you hear this credits music, and then you're just like, wow, I feel accomplished. I feel like I actually did something here. And this music makes you feel like that, like you, you're a success, that you got through a challenge. And that's what this game is. It is a challenge. And with that, with going on that rent, and oh my god, this was developed by Intelligent Systems? Whoa! I did not know that! You know what, Intelligent Systems? Why don't you team up with Retro and make the next Mario Kart? I swear that I did not know this. Wow! Intelligent Systems are the ones responsible for Paper Mario, but wow, I never knew they made this game. Oh my goodness, they should seriously team up. I'm not even joking about that, but that's it, guys. Thank you for joining me for this series, and hope you guys continue to play Mario Kart and support it throughout all the years. Can't wait for the next one on the Wii U. It just, it's a series that's going to keep getting better and better, and I can't wait to see the future. So this is it. This is Mario Central, signing off.